Uh, after working in IBM for seven and a half years, I had to take a break uh, because of uh, my personal priorities. And then uh, when I had to restart the career with four year break, there was a lot of uh, difficulty in getting placed because of the career gap. When I joined DXC, I wanted to upskill myself uh, with latest technology and trends and I was looking for different arenas uh, which would make that possible. I looked into different options like self-study but then self-learning um, without a direction, without a curriculum wasn't helping. That's why I've en enrolled with a dual degree program uh, which is PG Diploma with IIIT Bangalore and MSc with LJMU. IIIT Bangalore itself is reputed in the industry and offers much of uh, uh, courses. So I thought this is the best bet and it will help me in long term. One thing that made me help to MSc LJMU is that it is proper degree, proper postgraduate degree and it is recognized for PhD. Uh, in further, if I'll have to uh, pursue PhD, it is recognized as proper postgraduate degree. In IT industry, there is there is never enough uh, with learning. You'll all have always have to upskill yourself with different technologies and latest trends in order to stay up to the mark with the industry. So when I when you ask that if uh, uh, it would be redundant for an experienced professional, so I would say uh, it wouldn't be much of redundancy rather than revision. Um, the course of upgrad is de designed in such a way that both beginners and experienced professionals can make advantage out of it. My MSc project, no, it is uh, based on the facial expression recognition. So, uh, based on a picture, uh, it categorizes the expression into angry, sad, fear, uh, whatever it is. Why uh, I chose this project is equipment, uh, camera equipment for color images is costlier uh, rather than the gray or black and white. So if we go for lesser infrastructure, uh, will it differ in the expression recognition, be it the um, finding out the face or uh, finding the features. And there were difficulties to me when I was not able to understand the concepts at uh, first or when I needed little more uh, advice or little more mentorship from the industry experts. And during those times, Upgrad has readily agreed to uh, arrange one-on-one -on -one sessions or group discussions within the students, uh, with a student mentor in place and an industry exper expert to on the call. When there were many people who were not understanding the concepts, they were ready to arrange a live session so that all the batches benefited from the same. And at the end of day, when I see the certificate and um, when I uh, see that I have finally done the MSc and I'm an MSc holder now, it brings a smile to my face and I'm happy that I'm able to do it. <laughs>